Understanding, not my tempo, a guide to English idioms. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a fascinating English phrase, not my tempo. This idiom might sound musical, but it's used in various contexts. Let's explore its meaning, origin, and how you can use it in everyday conversations. Not my tempo primarily refers to a situation or pace that doesn't align with someone's preference or comfort zone. It originated from musical settings, where a conductor might tell a musician that their tempo, or speed of playing, is not in sync with the desired pace. However, it's now used broadly to indicate a mismatch in styles, approaches, or rhythms in various scenarios. Let's see how, not my tempo, is used in different contexts. 1. Workplace. If a project's pace is too fast for an employee, they might say, this project's schedule is not my tempo. 2. Personal relationships. When someone prefers a slower, more thoughtful approach to dating, they could use the phrase, rushing into things is not my tempo. 3. Learning environments. A student might say, this fast-paced course is not my tempo. I need more time to understand the concepts. The phrase gained widespread recognition from the movie, Whiplash, 2014, where a demanding music instructor frequently uses the term. This has led to its increased usage in everyday language, transcending its musical roots. When using, not my tempo, remember, it's best suited for informal settings. The phrase can subtly convey discomfort or disagreement. It's a polite way to express that something doesn't suit your style or pace. I hope this video helps you understand and use the phrase, not my tempo, confidently in English conversations. Remember, language is like music. It's all about finding the right tempo that suits your style. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.